What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another unofficial Bandhead Reaction video where I am your host, Orlando J. And today, we have a special one. I'm going to be reacting to the Michigan Wolverines Marching Band uh, 2022. This is a little different reaction for me, but I'm excited to do it, venturing out into new spaces in the marching band world. So I'm looking forward to seeing this. I have not seen Well, I, I saw the clip, and I, I clicked on it for like a couple seconds, and I heard the band... But I was like, you know what? I want to do a reaction to this because from what I heard, they sound amazing. But they always do, right? So I'm going to be reacting to uh, a, a band outside of the HBCU world, which is historically black college. Those of you who are new to the channel. Uh, and I'm going to react to uh, a PWI, which is a predominantly white institution. Uh, it doesn't mean that they don't have black students at their school, but uh, the predominant race there is white. And so the marching band style is different than what you would see at an HBCU. Um, that does not disqualify them from great musicianship, but it just shows that, you know, we have to, we have to become versatile, versatile across this space. So, uh, I'm going to react to the Michigan Wolverine Marching Band. Let's get into it. Nice. Shout out to the Marching Band, the Michigan Wolverine Marching Band. First of all, it's packed as H E double L hockey stick up in there. I <laughs> wish HBCUs was packed like that. It'll be jumping. For a very special halftime celebration, the 50th anniversary of women as members of the Michigan Marching Band. We begin led by one of the original 12 women from 1972. 1972. And the band plays above damn time. First of all, they sound amazing. Nice. Tongue game. It's dope. Ooh, the slur. Nice. Mm. Sound good. Sound like they're kissing me on the cheek. Oh, okay. Time. Is that title or time? Oh, title. Oh, okay, I see. Nice. That's real nice. Cursive writing. I can still tell what it is. That's 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 a good sign. That melody's so tight, I know I'm for sure I'm going to get a copyright on this. amazing all right all right so that's pretty much it guys so yeah my takeaway is this right so uh with michigan wolverine band versus like a, a hbcu band like uh you know a, a norfolk or a, a jackson or southern you know you could tell why most people would find the the hbcu bands uh pleasurable according to how you grew up within your culture right so within their culture you know blues brothers uh stuff like that final countdown different things like that is more like within their culture so that's what they play and they sound amazing playing it like there is no weaknesses across the sections um in regards to like overall the way you hear them when, when you hear them play like they sound real well balanced uh the tune is there it's very warm warm sound it's 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 inviting you know and it's and it's nice uh whereas in the hbcu band world you know you have more uh more power um and then there's power and balance like 
you know because just because they're born powerful doesn't mean that they're not balanced right that they have that balance it's just that that's how they play um it's and it's and it's fun to watch there's a little bit more entertaining whereas uh watching a pwi band or um or band outside of the hbcu world it's a little different they have they have a culture and they they stick to that culture um it's also difficult for those musicians to play other tunes outside of what they normally play you know they have they have sponsors they have people that that's paying very handsomely to to hear and see a certain type of sound so you know there's politics to it all i'm sure those musicians would love to play more hip-hop tunes and stuff like that but they just they just can't they it just doesn't fit their their culture and that's fine and so i appreciate the sound that they have and what they do and it's and it sounds awesome so if you guys enjoyed this make sure you go to the michigan wolverine band channel make sure you subscribe um thank you guys so much for bringing the content i really enjoyed watching that and uh shout out to michigan for their recent homecoming but anyways guys if you enjoyed this make sure you like this video subscribe comment down below let me know your thoughts this has been the unofficial band head where i'm your host orlando j and i'm out of here